हेलो बच्चो लेट्स रीड द क्वेश्चन द क्वेश्चन से डेट अ बॉल इज स्पन विथ एंगुलर एक्सेलरेशन अल्फा इज इक्वल टू सिक्सटी स्क्वायर माइनस टू टी वेर टी इज इन सेकेंड एंड अल्फा इज इन रेडियन पर सेकेंड एट टी इज इक्वल टू जीरो द बॉल हैज एंगुलर वेलोसिटी ऑफ टेन रेडियन पर सेकेंड एंड एंगुलर पोजिशन ऑफ फोर रेडियन द मोस्ट एप्रोप्रिएट एक्सप्रेशन फॉर द एंगुलर पोजिशन ऑफ द बॉल इज सो We will solve this question. First of all, we will see what will be the key concept used in this question. The key concept used in this question will be omega that is angular velocity that is equal to d theta by dt, where theta is the angular position. Theta is angular position. Omega is angular velocity, and alpha that is angular acceleration. That is d omega by dt. So from here we will have omega will be equal to integration of alpha dt and the angular position theta will be equal to integration of omega dt. So we have been given alpha is equal to sixty square minus two t. So omega will be equal to integration of alpha dt. That is integration of 60 square minus 2t dt. So that will be equal to integration of 60 square minus 2t dt, which will be equal to 60 square dt minus 2t dt. Now T square dt is t cube by three, so it will be and this will be six into t cube by three minus two into t dt is t square by two, and this will be plus c. So this will be three into three times two is equal to six, and these two will cancel. So this will be two t cube minus t square plus c. This will be Angular velocity omega, so angular velocity omega will be equal to two t cube minus t square plus c. Now we have been given at t is equal to zero, angular velocity is ten radian per second. So at t is equal to zero, omega is equal to ten radian per second. So we will just put the value of t is equal to zero in this. So we will have ten is equal to two into zero cube minus zero square plus c. So from here we will have c is equal to ten. So the value of c will be equal to ten. So omega will be equal to two t cube minus t square plus ten. This will be the Equation of omega that is angular velocity. So angular position theta will be omega dt. That will be integration of two t cube dt minus t square dt plus integration of ten dt. So this will be equal to t cube dt integrates to t to the power four. By four minus t square dt is t cube by three plus this will be ten t plus c. So theta is two. From here theta will be equal to t s t to the power four by two minus this is t cube by three. Plus ten t plus c minus t cube by three plus ten t plus c. So we have been given at t is equal to zero, theta is equal to four radian. So at t is equal to zero, theta is equal to four radian. So we will just put the value of Theta at t is equal to zero, so four will be equal to zero minus zero plus zero plus c. So from here c will be equal to four. 
therefore angular position theta will be equal to t4 by 2 minus t cube by 3 plus 20 plus 4. So the correct option will be option B. Hope you all understood it well. Best of luck.